Hey there, this is Tristan Schmidt. Just going to go over my uh, Unity project here. Uh, so I added in a uh, UI here with the text that will update every time that a score is added onto. Um, and so far, I, I just have a simple coin object here. Um, I have it as a prefab. The only issue is that I do have an animation on this prefab. Uh, thus, when I copy it or I try to duplicate the prefab, say I, I want to have multiple coins that go all the way down here, um, they will default to whatever the position is that's uh, specified for the uh, animation. So I'll just give you an example here. So when I run this, once it completes its domain, Took longer than she does. All right, there it goes. So yeah, as you can see, I have an animation on the coin. Um, so if I go up to it, I bring the player all the way up. It hits the coin, score updates, and the coin disappears. The coin's been collected, score has been updated. That all works great. Um, and that's how I used all of the provided scripts uh, for that to be possible um, on the coin object I have the trigger events behavior um, for both the animation to start on it and then also for the uh, coin to be disabled when the trigger happens. And then on the player, I have the character size score script, of course, and then this uh, simple trigger event behavior um, so that it will raise the trigger action when it's called. Um, and then it'll also update the label um, through the score event and the score in data. So I have that all working. Um, but as you can see, let's say I copy this, I put a new one in, and I don't want it to be right there, I want it to be right here. Um, when I hit play, since the, since the animation is on the coin as the prefab, you'll see it kind of jump here, and then it'll look like there's only one coin. Uh, there it goes. So now it jumps to where the default position is on the animation, not where I want it to be. Um, and we can see that, I don't know if I'm recording the animation tab, but the default X uh, and Z and well, the position values on the animation are at a default. So I maybe can't use this as a prefab. I might have to make each one separate. Um, so I still gotta mess around with that a little bit more or ha have a, a, a way where the animation only changes the Y value um, instead of the X and Z. So. Yeah, but everything else is working great. I, I am getting this layer error here too. I'm not quite sure what that is, um, but the score updates, the player can interact with the uh, coin. The coin will disappear when it's interacted with and the, and the score uh, will change um, according to that. So yeah, I have all that working. Um, but that's all, that's all, all I have for now. So I'll see you in the next one.